The ASU is full of innovative majors. Some of these majors are brand new, specifically tailored for the future. I'm going to go talk to some of the students, see what it's all about. This is You Asked. Would you say ASU is pretty good as far as keeping up with what's happening now, not kind of living in the past? I would definitely say so. Uh, we're, we're number one in innovation for a reason. For a reason. Um, yeah, I all like they actually constantly changing the curriculum for my major specifically because um, new tech is coming out. Right. So just like a couple weeks ago, they added a completely new class to the curriculum, working with like database design and all that. Yeah. So Brielle, um, first of all, what is your major? My major is digital culture with a concentration in art. How is this major? Um, kind of contributing to the way the world's going. I think one of the main things that we learn in digital culture is not only how to use the software and things that we need to make new media, but we also just learn how to be aware of what they might mean in society. My background is in creative and journalism and writing. Mm -hmm. So um, I pulled everything I could out of that and I realized that I actually missing two major parts which is the business knowledge and the technical knowledge. Great. And guess what? I started looking found for a fusion. major and found the one that literally does that. Or do lots of colleges offer this program? That's very unique to ASU. I haven't cool. found one that would be so targeted to this exact uh -huh. opportunity. So I'm actually a double major in um, MBB, which is Molecular Bioscience and Biotechnology, okay. and Violin Performance. MBB specifically, um, again, lets you have a different focus. If I want to study more uh, plant systems, I could do that. If I want to okay. study more bioinformatics, I could do that. Cool. And then on, with Violin, you can sort of decide. You have to do a certain amount of like large and small ensembles, yeah. but you can decide what those are. Alex, tell us what your major is. Uh, my major is Human Systems. Systems engineering. Human systems, what is that? So human systems engineering is like the combination of psychology and engineering kind of uh -huh. combined. So we do a lot of different things with like human factors and ergonomics, but anything that involves a human in any um, engineering system, we kind of help design that. So what's innovative about sports journalism, or at least the way you're doing it? I think it's innovative because a lot of the classes aren't like your typical class mm -hmm. where you go, you know, you study, you do all that. I think it's innovative because I've done a lot of career prep in my classes. Do they teach you how to deal with like difficult athletes that don't answer your questions? I'm just curious. Well, we do have an ethics course, and oh, really? so we kind of touch a little bit on that. On what might cross the line and, and what doesn't? Yeah, I really like my major map. Like, I think it makes a lot of sense the right. way it's laid out because it starts with something more broad and then it goes into detail. Oftentimes, like, technology integrates into all the parts of our lives, so we're just really aware of like, the implications and I think that because of that we have a lot of power to change society. They're saying most of the data jobs will be completely new within 10 years especially and in, in, in my specific industry of entertainment data um, there's there are people working on algorithms right now to like write movie scripts without like people involved at all like the actual tech doing that. Cheapers. There's con it's constantly shifting it's constantly changing and it's really smart that as a university we've kind of stayed at the forefront of that. Boy am I inspired hopefully you are too to. Uh, you should come to ASU, learn about all the cool majors that we have to offer. We're really changing the world out here, doing our thing. And, you know, be sure to like and subscribe to these videos. Keep watching. Ask more questions. This is You Asked. I'm Ben. That's it.